Hey, what's going on everybody? This is a quick tutorial on how to get the Unity remote set up for your Android devices. I seem to run into a huge problem trying to find the SDK folder after installing Android Studio and I just couldn't seem to be able to link it. I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. When you go to edit, preferences, and you go to your external tools, this was blank for me and I couldn't figure out where the file folder was, uh, it was hidden, and I couldn't figure out how to unhide it. So I had a whole lot of trouble doing that. So I want to show you how I was able to quickly discover the file location and how to get it going. So the first thing I did was just go to Android Studio. If you already have it downloaded and installed, um, and you should have it for whatever version of your phone uh, or tablet that you have. So in my case, mine's 5.0. Uh, you're going to go to SDK Manager after going to Configure. And then uh, so you can see which one I have uh, selected once I installed that. You're just going to go up here and you're going to take this link up here, or this address. And you're not going to be able to right click it, but just Control C to copy it. And then you're going to take it into Unity. And then now you're going to be able to go to your preferences go here, and then you're just going to paste that address down here, the select folder, and it should automatically come up. Mine did, uh, and now it works really well. So as long as you have that set up, uh, your build settings are set for uh, Android devices, and also when you go down to uh, your editor and project settings, that you make sure this is set for any Android device as well. And then when you hit play, as long as your phone is set up in the developer mode, it should start working. Uh, it's definitely started working for me, and now everything is awesome. So I hope this worked for you guys. It definitely worked for me. Uh, give me feedback. If you have any questions, I'll post some links in the description too.